Hi 2E people, I am giving you a gift today and it is called the invisible pause button. We can press this pause button at any time. Very few things need immediate attention. I'm gonna repeat that. Very few things need our immediate attention as a parent, as a 2E adult, even as a 2E teacher, a teacher of 2E kids. So if you're a parent, and your kiddo has sensory sensitivities, emotional overexcitability, uh, needs processing time, time to think through what you're talking to him or them about, press your pause button. If your child, your student, yourself is melting down, press the pause button. Take a deep breath, remember, you're likely in your amygdala, which means you might not be your best self at this moment, or your child may not be their best self at this moment. And so if you can press that pause button, give yourself, your child, your student grace, likely when you do address whatever's happening, their feelings, your feelings, they're meeting your expectations, you feeling frustrated, likely you're gonna be able to address the situation, the issue, the problem, while being in your thinking brain, your prefrontal cortex. In fact, when you press that pause button, you know what else you should press? Right here. Remind yourself, like Winnie the Pooh, think, think, think. Yeah, Winnie the Pooh knew what to do. Press that pause button, press this part of your head, tune in to you, tune in to your child, and give yourself some time. Because when we are emotional, when we are defensive, when we are feeling attacked, triggered, we don't tend to respond in the best, most productive way. So utilize this pause button, take a break, take a second, take a breath. And then remember what your goal is, whether it's your goal to accomplish something, whether it's your goal regarding a relationship, and focus on that goal and what can you do that's gonna further that goal or get you closer to that goal. So don't forget, press the pause button, remind yourself of the thinking brain, and move forward in that way.